Background Shore Z Productions is the production company of David Shore. November 16, 2004, May 21, 2012, March 1, August 7, 2015, July 13, 2017. Logo. Just a simple logo with a large white capital Z with the word Shore at the top also in white something white and blurry is behind the logo. FX SFX. None music. Sounds. None. Availability. Uncommon appears on Battle Creek House the 2007 made for TV movie Winter's Sneaky Pete is the Good Doctor. Credits. Background. This is Samuel Baum's vanity card. January 21st, 2009, September 13th, 2010. Samuel Baum Productions. Logo. On a black background, we see Samuel Productions in the engraver's gothic font, which is also used as the end credits font for Lie to Me. FX, SFX, none. Music, sounds, none. Availability. Seen on the first two seasons of Lie to Me. Editor's note. None. Cherry Tree Entertainment. Credits. October 2, 2000, February 15, 2006. Logo. We see a watercolor painting of some cherry trees in blossom, grass, and roads. On the bottom of the screen is white text that reads, Cherry Tree Entertainment. FX, SFX, None. Music, sounds. The closing theme of Yes, Dear. Availability. Seen on Yes, Dear. Function Entertainment. Background. This is John Turtletop's vanity card. September 20th, 2006, August 10th, 2012. Junction. Logo. On a white background, we see a blue box with Junction 97 road sign on a pole, lit by two searchlights. Below the box, there are words like this, J-U-N-C-T-I-O-N-E-N-T-E-R-T-A-I-N-M-E-N-T in black text. FX, SFX. None. Music. Sounds. None. Availability. Appeared on Jericho, Harper's Island, and Common Law. Nitwits. Credits. Background. This is the production company of Dave Finkel and Brett Baer. September 20th, 2011, May 15th, 2018. American Nitwits. Logo. Against a white background. There is a rounded green tinted photo of two men, most likely Dave Finkel and Brett Bear themselves, sitting and laying on the back of a 1970s-like car behind a wall, with a small piece of tape attached to the photo on top. Above it is the company name in a scratched-out, basketball-like font in black. FX, SFX, none. Music, sounds. None or the closing theme. Availability. Seen on New Girl. Don't expect this to appear on Bad Sisters, despite Finkel and Bayer's involvements. Chicken Sticks. October 29, 2009, December 9, 2015, March 4, 2020. Logo. On a black background, we see an image of a puppy. Possibly a Labrador Retriever, running on the grass with dead leaves. The words chicken sticks are under the image while there are paw prints underneath the text. Variant. Starting with Season 2 of The League as well as on Dave, the logo has the image of an adult Labrador Retriever, possibly the same one from the previous logo, sitting at the beach and the text has been modified. FX, SFX, the zooming, music, sounds, the closing theme of the show, availability, seen on the FX series The League and Dave, editor's note, none, Sage, credits, background, this is Emily Halpern and Sarah Haskins' vanity card, September 26, 2019, March 12, 2020, H plus H, logo, on a white, letterboxed background, we see cartoon renderings of young Sarah Haskins and Emily Halpern sitting together, reading their books. Above them is, 
H plus H in an American typewriter font. FX, SFX, none. Music, sounds, none. Availability. Seen on Carol's second act. Editor's note, none. Credits, April 21st, 2017. Here we go. Logo. On a white background, we see a drawn picture of an antenna television with a speech bubble above it. Inside is the words, here we go. FX, SFX, none. Music, sounds, the closing theme. Availability. Seen on Girl Boss. Editor's note, none. Himmelfilms. Background. This is the vanity plate of David Himmelfarb. September 21st, 2004, June 6, 2006. Himmel Films. Logo. A shot of Manhattan is seen against a purple. Background. The word H-I-M-M-E-L-F-I-L-M-S appears underneath. The setting is at night and a moon is rising. FX, SFX, the moon rising. Music, sounds. We hear David Himmelfarb saying, heavenly. Availability. Seen on Rodney. Editor's note, none. Joe vs. Joe. Credits. Background. This is the vanity card of Joe Port and Joe Wiseman. October 7th, 2021. Logo. On a gray background, we see pixel illustrations of Joe Port and Joe Wiseman facing off to each other, with the pixel text 1P and 2P below them respectively. Above them is Joe vs. Joe, also in the same fashion. Variant. On CBS airings of the show, the logo is zoomed in. FX, SFX, none. Music, sounds. The end theme of the show or a generic theme. Availability. Seen on the USA adaptation of Ghosts. Editor's note, none. How to skin and debone a fish. Good butter. Credits. Background. This is the vanity plate of Josh Ronz. Anyone can do it with... Step one, Logo. Enough, on a black background, we see a picture of the interior of a refrigerator, with some foods inside such as milk and butter. A man is seen dancing on top of the lid of the butter. Underneath the picture are the words, good butter, with a slab of butter in the middle of them. FX, SFX, the man dancing. Music, sounds. A group of kids sang the company name in unison. On the pilot episode, the kids sound more off sync. Availability. Seen on undercovers. Editor's note. It's considered a funny logo, especially in contrast to the show and the bad robot logo it follows. Intelligible grunt. Background. Unintelligible grunt is John Glazier's vanity card. April 1st, 2008, December 11th, 2015. Logo. On a white background with two trees at the bottom left corner of the screen, we see a man wearing a balaclava. A speech bubble saying, unintelligible grunt, pops up. FX, SFX, the speech bubble popping up. Music, sounds. We only hear the man saying, H-E-E-E-A-U-G-H, as if he's grunting unintelligibly. Availability. Seen on Delocated and Neon Joe, Werewolf Hunter. Editor's note, none. Credits. Background. This is the vanity plate of Bruce McCulloch. October 2nd, 2007, March 4th, 2008. Trant. Logo. On a concrete-like background, we see the Three Arts Entertainment logo in a box to the right, and to the left is another box with an illustration of a young boy flying inside, colored in purple and hues, against a pale green gradient background. Below the boy is the text T-R-O-N-T. FX, SFX, none. Music, sounds, upbeat seven-note theme.
Availability. Seen on carpoolers. Editor's note. Considering Bruce McCulloch was a member of the kids in the hall, the weirdness of this logo may be intentional. Ruby's Tuna. Credits. Background. This is the vanity card of where the Miller's actor Jason Sudeikis. August 14, 2020. Logo. We see a picture of a bowl of tuna with a spoon in it sitting on a table. FX, SFX, none. Music, sounds. A man, possibly Jason Sudeikis himself, saying, Ruby. Availability. Seen on Ted Lasso. Editor's note. This logo is very notable for not showing the company name. The Scott Peters Company. Credits. Background. This is the vanity plate of Scott Peters. November 3rd, 2009, May 18th, 2010. Logo. On a black background, we see a light blue image of silhouetted monarch butterflies. A silhouetted man also appears in the image, with only his hand visible. The text The Scott Peters Company is aligned to the middle. FX, SFX, none. Music, sounds, none. Availability, seen on the first season of the 2009 V Revival. Editor's note, none. One Light Road Productions. Credits. Background. This is Paul Schering's vanity card. February 14th, 2013, May 30th, 2017. Logo. On a black background, we see an image of in-country road with grass, with distant trees, and a streetlight during sunset. Underneath is One Light Road Productions. Variant. On zero hour, the word Productions is removed. FX, SFX, none. Music, sounds. Crickets chirping or none. Availability. Seen on Zero Hour in the fifth season of Prison Break. Editor's note, none. September 30th, 2002, March 8th, 2006. T Gal and Java Boy Productions. Nickname, The Two Cups. Perfect. Logo. Over a black background, we see two white cups. Then we reveal a film strip surrounding the two cups on a background. The text T Gal and Java Boy Productions in black appears below the film strip. Variant. On the first nine episodes of Still Standing, the logo is still. FX SFX, the film strip zoom out surrounding the two cups. Originally, it's a still logo. Music, sounds, the closing theme of the show or a generic CBS theme. Availability, seen on still standing. Editor's note, none. Background, this is Lan Biederman's vanity card. September 21st, 2006, May 20th, 2008. Logo. On a wall, we see a trash can with papers below. Above it is the text, Deforestation Services. FX, SFX, none. Music, sounds, none. Availability. Seen on Shark. Editor's note, none. Only Blue's Clues US and UK confirmed episodes. You don't have a mail time Kevin. The Sniffles lost KBS Korean or Portuguese Hanshup Shen and Duarte Gomes a screenshots. Also, sneezing music stopping Steve Comley male blue barking stops.